New York Jets youngster Elijah McGuire is a terrific young back. It's not showing yet because of lack of opportunity and lack of O-line strength, but he really does have it all. Vision, awareness, uh, receiving ability out of the backfield. There's a fourth and one. Split zone, split inside zone. Supposed to go up the A-gap. There's McGuire. There goes the tight end on the split. Also a jet sweep. James Carpenter can't get a cross face, so it looks like it's going to be a loss of yardage, but look what McGuire does. Doesn't force it down the A-gap. Jukes it to the, to the left. Jukes another defender and picks up 13. Rewind it a little bit. Most young backs, when facing this situation, freeze. Or they try, or they try to lower their shoulders and get the one yard based on getting stuffed. McGuire, vision. Here's another terrific example of Elijah McGuire. His vision in the zone scheme. The Jets go with a pitch right that gets 18. And although it's called back for holding, it's again, it's a perfect example of his vision. By the way, pitch right, something I haven't seen since Tecmo Super Bowl. It's never really done in the NFL, but anyway. Here's what happens as soon as he gets it, this is what he sees. The A gap looks great. The weak side looks great on the cutback. But if he would have taken either of those routes, the Bills would have had it covered on the second level. Instead, he's patient. He sees Brandon Shell is outside and unmanned. He eludes the edge defender coming up. You'll see right here. And there's the hold. Goes around Brandon Shell and picks up 18 as he tiptoes down the sideline. It's a great example of patience, even though the hold came. This one's more reaction, athleticism. First and 10, draw. It only goes for two, but it should have been a minus five, minus six. We know it's supposed to go up the B gap to the left on the draw because Harrison is pulling left. McCown, draw to McGuire. Look at James Carpenter completely blow his assignment. He had no other assignment but that man. Harrison pulls, McGuire's done, right? Nope, decisive. Right to the right side. Doesn't try to force it up the B gap. Good play. Yes, Elijah McGuire can run through the tackles as well. Third and four against the Miami Dolphins, his first game of the season. He goes for seven on this inside power. Supposed to go up the A-gap. James Carpenter's pulling. Watch when he gets the ball right now, he has a decision to make. If he goes up the A-gap, Kiko Alonso is there. He's still behind the line of scrimmage. But he can turn it outside to the left because the defender is turned inward. He decides to take the safe yardage and get the first down moving forward perhaps most impressive about young mcguire is that he could play receiver he is a legit running back receiver threat who could line up on the outside jeremy bates classic empty set as all the fans love uh probably 11 personnel in the empty set it's a five yard in against cover two man Watch this right, left, right, and he leans in while he catches the ball. Watch it again. Leans in and doesn't lose focus. That is a veteran wideout skill set.